And I'm making this movie right now for the American people to show you what I am doing in an effort to regain our republic that the Founding Fathers gave us. And apparently, only one person was interested, the mayor's wife, who asked Benjamin Franklin, what have you done today? And he said, we have given you a republic, madam, if you can hang on to it. So now we're going to hang on to it. I'm doing this for all of you people that do not have knowledge. I've spent 21 years, almost 21 years, April 19th this year. It'll be 21 years exactly. Finding out all this information to get back our republic. So I have the envelope here. I'm, you're my proof of service. This is the... Uh, uh, a priority mail envelope. It's addressed to the U.S. House of Representatives in care of the Sergeant of Arms, Paul D. Irving. It's going to room H-124, U.S. Capitol, Washington, District of Columbia, 20515. What I'm placing in the envelope, I'm doing this right in front of you. Yes, this is Madonna. I have the Madonna. I have the Book of Life. I have the Ark of the Covenant. And I have your honors, okay? I have your honors. So now this is the time and this is the season. All these people are quitting in Congress. They're quitting because they either know something or they're scared. Now I'm not afraid because I have God. I'm not afraid of anything. Now some people make me nervous, but if you have faith in God, you shouldn't be worried at all. So now I have a two-page document. I'll be posting this for all of you. But like I said before, I didn't think it was fair to actually put it in the mail. So it is going in the mail, and I'm showing you that. So this is a two-page letter to Brother Paul, the Sergeant of Arms. Okay, it's a two-page letter. Here you look at it. It's a two pages. It tells him what's in the package. Okay, now what is going in with it, and then I'm going to put it all together. So these two pages, I'm going to set it right here. This is a 12-page letter. This is number one on the documents, a 12-page letter to Speaker of the House. Then there is my educational document that I have given out to quite a few people. Most of them haven't paid any attention at all. It's okay. They'll get the paperwork when God wants them to have it. This is on legal tender status and this is posted on my blog. It's called Fed Chart. Okay, that's going in. So I'm going to put all these over here showing you what's going in. This is another one of my writings. It's been in several of my classes. It's entitled Political Paper. This is also on my blog. And this is not on my blog yet, but it will be. This is the document that was sent to me when they returned my gold and silver case. Now, the sheriff in Lincoln County has a copy of the only copy that I have. It's on the Sacred Oath of Office. If you go on my on my YouTube channel, C Vegas Lass L A S S, uh, you can see Sacred Oath one, two, and three. Now, this is what's going on. It it's not the sheriff's and the deputy's faults because they didn't know either. Now, nobody really knows. Um, some people are finding out. But anyway, this is an order signed by James Earp, the judge of the 18th Judicial District, Brevard County, Florida. And this is a case where I have all their oaths of office with the exception of the uh, state senator and the congressman. Those are kept somewhere else. I'm not sure where that is yet, but all the other state, you know, from the governor on down. I have their oath of office. The only thing that was not in the package was a certified copy of the original Florida Constitution. That is in the case. It is the Ark of the Covenant. I do have it. I do have it, and I will make another video on that. It's not opened, but this is the paper because they sent it back to me, basically, because they couldn't let the judge really see it because... They probably would have dropped in. So, I'll have it though. I'll have it. I had 15 good people call the jail, find out 
what they accept for bail and they have a policy that they're not allowed to accept coins. So now I have a problem with that because they all take an oath of office to support and defend the Constitution. Article 1, Section 10 says no state shall make anything but gold and silver coin a tender and payment of debts. They had Star David over their heart. See, we can't let our sheriffs fail. They're all in prison. Everybody's in prison. The money's in prison. We have to get it out. So that's what we're doing. You know what? This is the order that's going in there. I've scanned a copy of it. All the whole package. I'm going to make a movie for everybody. Then I have the table of contents. This is eight pages of what is on. I have the four to five documents, which I do have posted the key ones, 28 key ones, because the other ones you have to look through a viewer and you can go to the Maryland's website. Okay, didn't have time to just, it's a lot of work. Okay, so I'm trying to shortcut some of this stuff for y'all. This is number six on it. This is the disc, 45 documents. Then number seven, these are my private papers, uh, my passport application, and some other documents, things that I've done in an effort to get back my country. My country. Okay, then I also put in there what's going in here is a set of discs for the uh, Sergeant of Arms, Paul D. Irving, got one for him, it's backwards to you, that's going in, then one for Senator Rand Paul, because Kentucky, that's my birth state, that's where my nativity occurred, okay, and Kentucky had a resolution, they were not allowed to vote in the first presidential election, okay, they're 15th state, key number. 15 surety barons I got and this is to Senator Harry Reid because Harry Reid is the only one that gave us any information of on the Ruby Valley Treaty and I believe he's very important even though a lot of you out there you really don't like some of these people but they're doing things that you don't even know about so here's these three envelopes this is going in the envelope and here's the two number seven and number six these are going in because this is for the Speaker of the House, John Boehner. Okay, and then the table of contents. I'm putting them all back in order again here. Um, because I want it to look nice. And I'll show it. I'll hold it up so you can all see it. Because they're all tabbed out. Now yeah, it's number four. Okay, i got to get back on because I only have a couple paper clips. I don't want to staple these because I've asked Mr. Irving if you would please make copies of this. Because I don't have ink and paper. 